today, if you read the New York Law Journal, they basically say they have no case against Trump. But I'm here, stuck here, and I can't campaign. I'd rather be right now in Iowa. I'd rather be in New Hampshire or South Carolina or Ohio or a lot of other places, but I'm stuck here because I have a corrupt attorney general that communicates with the DOJ in Washington to keep me nice and busy because I'm leading Biden in the polls by a lot. That's all this is. This is election interference. They made up a fake case. They're fraudulent people. And the judge already knows what he's going to do. He's a Democrat judge. In all fairness to him, he has no choice. He has no choice. He's run by the Democrats. I know this city better than anybody knows this city. There's nobody knows it like I do. He's a Democrat judge out of the clubhouses. He's controlled, and it's a shame. What's going on here is a shame. Our whole system is corrupt. This is corrupt, Atlanta is corrupt, and what's coming out of D.C. is corrupt. But this is a good one because this one is interesting. Why attend? This one is very interesting. Why attend? Because I want to point it out to the press how corrupt it is because nobody else seems to be able to do it. Mr. New York Law Journal, New York Law Journal today did a very good job. And others have done a good job. They say there's no case here. But we have a corrupt attorney general that tried to make a case. Thank you very much. Again.